Hello friends, I am Lakeisha and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about this Be Healthy, Be Active, and Be Happy planner. I love it so much. It's so colorful and beautiful. It has these shiny blue discs. And Stephanie Fleming, the owner of Happy Planner, gave us this at the Black Women Who Plan and Create Conference. Stephanie was so sweet. She signed this for me and it's so pretty. Look at the colors guys. It is really beautiful and it just motivates you to go in and plan. So I am going to plan this upcoming week. Um, this particular happy planner has categories in it. It has a spot for today at the top. Um, focus, food, and exercise. Here are my fitness stickers from Happy Planner. They're attached to other Happy Planner stickers that are in green, um, in green packs. I just like to organize them by color and some of those are like dates and quotes and stuff like that. So as you can see, this planner is already categorized for you, which is very nice. It even has a water tracker. So I am going to be using this to track all these um, parts of my health, including my mental and emotional health, which I will show you later. So this weekend, I have to go to the gym, guys. I have been neglecting and ignoring the gym, and I really need to go. So I am going to exercise at home during the week and on the weekend I'm going to go to the gym also this week I want to focus on my food I really eat whatever is around and I don't really plan and I think that will make a big difference in my health journey if I plan that so I'm um, going back down to the exercise piece I like a variety of exercise so I'm gonna do yoga then I'm gonna do some type of cardio I might use my app I have an app called 8 fit um, I don't know if you have heard of it but it's a really good app to exercise with if you don't have a lot of time the exercises are uh, like cross training exercises and they're only about eight minutes so it's not bad and um and then i'm also going to walk outside hopefully the weather will cooperate with me but um this week i want to exercise i want to really eat more purposefully and eat clean uh, i'm not a diet person i'm not into the keto diets and all those kinds of diet. The word diet just makes my stomach hurt. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just don't like diets. But I do like the idea of a healthy lifestyle, eating healthy, staying away from processed food. So I am going to try my best not to eat out at all this week. Nope, not even on the weekends. I am want to plan my meals out. So I'm just going to put these stickers here to help motivate me and kind of section off this food log. So I'm gonna put breakfast, lunch, and dinner here later on off camera after I set this week up. But I'm really excited about the possibility of tracking what I eat. Next up here, there's also a goal, a space for your goals for the week. So I'm gonna use these stickers to help with my goals. This is um, a scale that I'm gonna use and I'm just gonna track, um, write the goal for my pounds in that section. I'm just going to put a goal of not quitting my regiment because I often quit. That's why I need this planner, honey. And um, I'm gonna also track my steps. I have a Fitbit, so that can I can do that on the app as well. And I have to motivate myself because it's a slow process. Just keep going. And I have to keep reminding myself, don't quit. Keep going. Everything is incremental. So this top part is the today section, which I really like. It's like an open book. You can um, reflect here. You can track things here. You can write, use it as a journal. I'm going to use it to track my um, mental and emotional health, my power hour. And I'll tell you about that in a minute. So my goals for um, this week in terms of pounds, I would like to lose two pounds. I'm not putting a lot on myself because um, this is the first time I'm setting that as a goal. And so I want to try to have a marginal uh, possibility of success. I'm also going to take 10,000 steps a day. 
Now I've done this before. It's really easy for me to hit the 10,000 steps a day if I clean the house. So that will motivate me to clean my house because I go up and down the stairs and around. I'm also going to track my water intake through drinking, trying to drink eight cups a day. I've gotten up to five cups a day, but I really want to get to eight. Now back to the power hour. I actually got this idea from Tony Robinson. He is a self-help guru and he says every morning he takes an hour to get ready for the day. And so I found that I had to get up an extra hour in the morning. So you have to go to bed early and wake up early so you can do this. So it's 20 minutes of exercise, 20 minutes of reading, something positive and inspirational, and 20 minutes of meditation and prayer. And when I say I see a big difference in my day when I do this, I really do. And then this week, I really want to focus on my self-care. Like the holidays, I have been giving my time, talent, and treasure to everybody else. And now I want to give it to myself, triple T myself, okay? <laughs> so I'm going to do a hair care routine on Monday and just um, pamper my hair and moisturize it and do my little do. I'm going to listen to my favorite music on Tuesday and I'm going to work in my TN on Wednesday because I have to give my TN some time and attention. Um, I use it like a journal and a memory keeper. And so down here where the exercise is, I'm going to get a little specific and write where I'm going to get it from. So I'm going to do yoga off YouTube, 8 Fit off cardio, and I'm going to walk outside. And um, this will help me keep myself together. So I'm speeding this up because I'm doing the same thing at the end of the week that I did at the beginning of the week. And so on Thursday, adding to my self-care, I'm going to pin some Pinterest ideas for my videos and for decorating my home. On Friday, I'm going to clean my makeup brushes because you're supposed to, I heard that you're supposed to clean your makeup brushes every week, but I have not been doing that. So I need to catch up with that so I can keep my face clear because I heard it does cause pimples when you don't brush your, clean your makeup brushes often. And Saturday, I'm going to watch a movie. And Sunday, yes, I'm going to treat myself to a glass of red wine. I love red red wine guys I really do so let me finish up this um, food section and also finish up the week for my exercising so I can get a really good idea of my health for the week so looking at this planner um, I found that I could also add Zumba in there at 830 at the gym which I like to do so looking at this planner guys I think I'm all set for the week I'm going to fill in the rest off camera I will let you know next week how I did um, sometimes I do a horrible job with my health sometimes I do an amazing job but this week I am claiming victory See you next time. Bye.